This is a, uh, an 82 acre site, stand of uh, 1999 Loblolly. We thin this as a clean chip and, and uh, fuel wood chipping operation as a fifth row thin in the late fall of 2012. Today is June the 4th, 2013. And as you can see, we put fire on the ground this morning. It is now 2.30 p.m. And with an east-southeast wind at two to five miles per hour late morning, we started our, started our ignition at 10.45 a.m. Humidity at that time was 68% with a temperature around 85 degrees. It is now 2.30 p.m. Uh, we have done strip heads and flanking on this fire on this entire 82 acres. Fortunately, we, we uh, were able to use a power torch on a four-wheeler rather than having to pull a drip torch the entire time. We, I did use a drip torch on some, some of the places, but as you can see, uh, there's a fire ladder right there, but our flame height on this track has been one to two feet at the maximum. We're having an excellent burn, nice homogeneous burn. Um, the humidity now at 2.30 p.m is 48% with a 95 degree ambient temperature. And I'm going to uh, take you uh, through some of this burn here. Uh, because we were able to fuel with this, we had some flat slash in here, but not as much as you would expect in terms of tops. And most of the slash was that of some hardwood shrubs and, and mid-story stuff that we just cut out. Uh, to help this stand when we uh, thinned it out. There's a fifth row thinning and in between. This is what it's uh, looking like uh, at 2.30 p.m. Walking through this burn. We're gonna have excellent uh, control of hardwood shrubs and understory. Appears to be no crown scorch thus far, but you know, we'll wait about a week and get a confirmation on that but very pleased how this has turned out. Sorry I did not uh, have any video on the ignition, but you gotta do what you gotta do here. The main reason for doing this, even this looks like a fairly clean plantation, we're gonna have some woody return uh, and competition in this stand and we wanted to go ahead and do a, a growing season burn on this initially. I had burned this place as dormant season burns to decrease the fuel reduction. For a fuel reduction burns uh, over the last uh, four to six years uh, doing dormant season burns. But uh, this is what it looks like. Uh, a great looking fire. Just slowly just eating that vegetation up. We will get great uh, um, rebirth of uh, legumes and grasses and forbs in this plantation within the next week to two weeks. Fires nicely back and through. And you can see some of these uh, vines and whatnot and we've got a nice tree left here. Okay, that should do it for the day. We'll stay around here for an hour or so, make sure we got uh, no flames and uh, recheck this uh, a few hours later, of course, uh, and staying on site until we know that we got good control, which we already know that, but uh, of course we won't leave this fire uh, burning. 